Morning, guys. Happy Easter again. Easter only starts today for me, really, because the boys have been at the dad's all most of the weekend. So I've just hidden all their eggs. Um, we're doing it early, the Easter egg hunt, because they're going on Preston North End football match this afternoon. So we're going to do it early. And when they come back from football, I'm going to do them a little buffy with pizzas and hot dogs and what have you. So, I've got such a terrible memory. I've only hidden the eggs this morning. I've forgotten half of where I've put them anyway. So, it's as much a secret to me as it is to boys when they find them. I've done our Alfie a bag. I don't, Alfie's 14 now. He don't want to. He don't want to be doing Easter egg hunts, I don't think. So, I've done him a bag with eggs in. All his eggs are in there. I've done my daughter an Easter cake. And these are the bags for the other two. When they come in, they'll come charging in and charging round. And it just takes... Tony takes them about five minutes to run round and get them all. But they go on, they'll go on the football and when they come back, I know what they'll do. They'll start hunting again because they'll think they've missed some. And uh, they might have missed some because sometimes they do miss some and I, and I forgot where I've put them, so it's a surprise. Um, but sometimes they're disappointed because they've got them all. You can't go on forever, can you? And I've only got so many blooming hiding places. So let the fun begin. I usually put some in the garden as well, guys. But as usual, it's pouring down. After nice days we've had, so they're all in the house. Them hard. Oh, how do you know? Start hunting, boys! Start hunting! Look at that lot, guys. But when I think they've had a right good do. <laughs> they've just nipped home now with some of their eggs. They're coming back for these in a bit. I'm going to make them a buffy for the tea when they come back from football. And there'll just be one or two more little bits hidden later on. Frankie makes me laugh. He's only, he's 11. And he said, oh, Nana, you must have spent a fortune on eggs. <laughs> I said, I started buying them as soon as they came out at shops. Which I do.